50 students will need to find a new place to live at Illinois Wesleyan University when they come back from Christmas break. Good Wednesday evening. I'm Tyler Lopez. Thanks for joining us. A broken water main pipe has made a student apartment building unlivable with their possessions still inside, and some will have to pay out of pocket to replace all of that. John Schoenheider joins us now with what this means for the building's former residents in our top story. John. That's right, Tyler. A water pipe burst Christmas Eve at Gates Frick Student Apartments on the Illinois Wesleyan campus, and that damage is forcing out 45 students on one side of the building who were away on Christmas break at the time. When students at Gates Frick Apartments come back from the holiday break, they're going to need a new place to stay. Flooding from a burst water pipe made the building uninhabitable. A university spokesperson issued a statement saying, quote, all residents are being offered single room housing on campus. However, the school won't reimburse the residents for their damaged belongings. If you have stuff, you should have a, a policy to protect you, whether you're a homeowner or a renter. And renter's policies are very inexpensive. Scott Holman with the Insurance Information Institute, a group dedicated to insurance education, says planning for protection is key for situations like this. Make sure that you keep a list of everything that's been damaged document with photos of you if you can and then save any receipts for anything that you spend including um, if you have to live someplace else like a motel or a hotel that includes checking if students still have coverage from their family's insurance plans it might come down to the terms of their policy that but they might want to check with their agent to see if if they're away at school, if they have any coverage under the family policy. If not, students may want to consider other options. When schools don't cover the cost, Holman says that means taking matters into your own hands. Talk with your insurance company or your insurance agent about making sure you have the kind of protection that you need. Now, we did reach out to school representatives again today for comment on the damage, and they said it will take several weeks to, quote, determine the cost and timeline for repairs. Though tomorrow, we'll sit down with the Director of Residential Life for more on the situation, and we'll keep you updated on the air and online as we learn more about that, Tyler.